Patrick, let's move to the side. As we announce, ito na yon, everyone has been waiting for this. The announcement of the eight finalists. And of course, right after, the question and answer competition will follow right after. Alright, ladies, are you ready? Contina lang, ladies. Kabahag City Sports Center, are you ready? Kinakabahan na sila, kaya tahimik na ang ating audience. Are you ready? Parang gusto pa natin mas balakas pa doon. Are you ready? First on the list is... Mutiahan! Pinabaktao! to promote tourism, particularly in Salmar, to youth engagement. In this generation, a youth are said to be adventurous. As a spokesperson, I highly believe that youth engagement is a powerful tool for the youngsters to foster the sentiments and value of our tourism. Let us always keep in mind that promoting tourism also means promoting unity amidst diversity. Hashtag Spark Salmar. You wished for it and you got it. Our next finalist is Mutia Han Gandara. in cases involving people's mental health is skyrocketing next to physical illness and complications. The fight for mental health care is a must. As a psychology student, I firmly believe that despite the complexities embedded into this discipline, as well as the predominating stigma surrounding mental health, we should all be aware of the rights that we have to proper treatment. With this, I am one with the greater majority who seeks to champion for mental health care services made accessible to everyone. Move forward! Mutiahan! Move forward! Mutiahan! Kapalogan! When I was strong Miss Manila God 2021, I was given the bigger opportunity to highlight my advocacy by working with the organization and kids' environmental wires. I had encountered a lot of social issues, and one that struck me most was the environmental problem, which is very prevalent in the community and in the shoreline of Makeda Bay. I was so disheartened to see a child playing in an environment with pile of garbages. I believe that it is, it is always the next generation who will continue to pursue the change that we wish to see in the world. Stay as pretty as you are because the next spot is yours, Mutia Han! Mutia Han Kalbayo! As a young woman who has grown up as an only child, I have become an advocate for children's awareness. Because I do firmly believe that every child deserves a better future and protection, especially from us elders. And as someone coming from that experience, I believe that I can, myself, become a beacon of hope and an inspiration to let them know that they are not alone and they deserve a brighter future. Stand proud because you're part of Tobit Mutiahan! Mutiahan! Santa Rita! Sustainable tourism, which everyone should be practiced in order to save our environment, to assist in the negative environmental and social impacts of tourism. It is not just only for the sake of preserving nature's beauty, but also for the future generations. You won't be going home just yet! Mutiahan! 
We are running out of spots, but the seventh spot is set for you, Mutiahan! Mutiahan Santorino! Congratulations, ladies! And now, to complete the top eight finalists, please take center stage, Mutia Han! source of livelihood in the beloved Basai, but also a reflection of what it is like to be a Basai man, our identity. With this, we must empower the protectors of our culture, the Bani viewers. With this, we have to provide them platform that will further enhance their skills in creative design, access to the of supply, and expand their market, not only here in the region, but globally, so that this art will not only survive, but thrive. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen, the eight finalists to the Mutiahan Summer 2022 class. Once again, what about a big round of applause? 